Yo, what's good? It's February 18th. Really late. Um, who I'm tired uh, and a bit woozy. We'll get into why. But this could be a rant. Might not be. We'll see. Um, so yeah, I had a playoff game tonight, senior playoff game. Um, do or die. Spoiler, we died. Uh, you know, I thought I got an okay sleep. Was kind of feeling tired throughout the day. A bit more than I would have liked. Um, and, you know, my legs did take a little bit to get into it. I mean, I kind of had a good couple rushes to start, and then they kind of... I don't know if they like were seasoned up or something, but there was a period of time in the middle of the game where they were kind of a bit wobbly and yeah, not not where I wanted them to be. But um, yeah, we lost. That sucks. Uh, I mean, I, it's not like we were the favorites even, or it's not like we would be likely to go all the way if we did win the series, but. I mean, it would have been nice to get in the game tomorrow, and then if we won, then the next series at the very least, just to, you know, for me to get the experience, and just because it's fun. But, yeah, that sucks. Um, the positives. Another pretty good game for myself. Um, another no goals against, so... That's seven games in a row that I wasn't on for a goal against. And then all, so the last three of the regular season and then four in the playoffs. Um, I don't know, just in the playoffs there were six plus five plus five plus four. The math is not working right now. I mean, that's 20 goals against on us. Four goals are in four games, and I'm not on for any. So, yeah. Another good defensive game. Um, you know, I think we did get running around a bit more than I would have liked when I was, when I was on. Um, but, you know, luckily still... Kept him to the outside for the most part. And the odd man rushes, we were able to shut down from back checks, which coupled by me. Um, there was kind of one bad play I had this game, which puck comes down on, into our end, and one D-man's battling kind of on the sideboards, it squeaks to the other D-man who's uh, behind the net, well, he's kind of to the side, and me being the winger, I go all the way down past the goal line to support him, so he feeds me a pass over, and it's kind of a bouncer off the boards, and it's spinning quite a bit, and then, yeah, it was also kind of fresh into the period, so uh, I went to receive it on the backhand, pretty much putting my stick right up against the boards, it just hit the stick, not e wasn't even going that fast. I just kept winged from the spin and just probably the angle that my stick was at right to their guy who was you know, just uh you know, maybe a foot or two um in front of the goal line. Luckily he wasn't directly in front of the net, obviously he was kinda into the side, so I mean he just got a shot off that I probably hit our goalie's pad or something. But yeah, that could have been worse. Um, so I don't know, that play kind of sticks out as a bad one, but... You know, other than that, it was all... Uh, you know, obviously not the best plays, because I'm still learning what the best is, but... Smart plays for the most part. Um, and... Yeah, I had some good rushes, drove wide a couple times, so that's good. Uh, but again, I gotta make that a habit and drive wide all the time. Uh, I'm not using 
the space that I have. When I am driving wide, I'm usually uh, too close to the D-man. You know, and there's still space between me and the boards that I can take and I can cut back, hit a trailer. Again, just so many options. I'm fast enough where I can just, should be able to just go all the way around behind the net too. But I'm learning how to judge the D-man's gap. And then the biggest thing is just carrying the puck with speed with my head up. So, I mean, luckily that's something that's a bit, I mean, it's, easy to practice in slower games and shinny based on the fact that you know I can keep my head up and drive wide against anyone and uh, practice that motion um, of course it is a bit different mentally when you're doing it in a game with checking with better demons who are have better gap control can close on you faster so yeah um that's a thing. But, yeah, my legs. Like, when they're full power, I feel like I should be able to do that. You know, every shift. But there were times when I got the puck and I rushed it out of the zone. And then, you know, maybe I dumped it deep just because I didn't feel like I had that extra juice. So, I don't know if that's an overexertion thing, conditioning thing. Maybe that's just inevitable with faster games. And if... I'm already three quarters of the way into a shift and I've already done some hard sprints and stops and starts. And yeah, but good, another good defensive game. Other than that one play really good on the breakouts. Um, actually there was, there was another play that, you know, it ended, it ended up being fine because where we lost the puck, it was no danger, but uh, we're breaking out of the zone. I'm playing on my off wing. I get it on the left side. And I look up and I start skating a little bit. But I probably could have kept skating the puck up more. Because um, there was pressure from behind me. And I don't know if that's what caused my pass to kind of go a bit haywire. But we had a guy driving along the boards on the other side of the ice. But I wanted to. And what was going to happen in my brain was just, you know, it was an open lane. There was absolutely no sticks in the way. So... You know, hard pass, hit him in stride, all the way across ice. And I don't know if it's just, yeah. I mean, I was looking up to see him. Maybe I just didn't judge where the stick was in relative to my ice when I was making the pass. Or maybe the kind of pressure behind me just uh, moved my stick or the puck a bit. But it ended up kind of being a wobbly saucer pass. Made it all the way to him, but it was a bit behind him. So it hit the boards, ended up going between his legs. And then to the D-man. So it was a... The D-man ended up getting at the far blue line. I think their D-man ended up just poking it forward after too. Because our guy was then right on him. So uh, yeah, ideally that's a tape-to-tape -tape pass. And then our guy's driving the zone. And then who knows what happens. But I had some pretty good setups in the O-zone. I mean... No points again. Our team only scored one goal. And yeah, my point totals really suffer when I don't play with a finisher because me not being one, pretty good at passing. But again, our team is kind of more of an energy forecheck team. So we struggle with finishing, me included. And so, uh, you know, lots of times I'll give guys good passes and uh, we just lack that little bit of finesse that, you know, maybe the goalie will save it or we'll fumble it or we'll overpass or something. So there's some notable plays there. I mean, and we had a two-on-one. I was hoping the puck would come across to me. I, I wasn't one with possession, but our guy took a shot. Uh, they were kind of getting sticks in the lane, but he could have sauced it over to me and I would have been all alone. So would have liked to get that. There was one where I turned the puck over from their goalie behind the zone. I mean, or behind their net. And the goalie, yeah, the goalie's behind the net. I played out front, thinking one of my four, at least one of my four checkers would go there. And they're just around the dots. I, I don't know why, but. And their guy's just right in the slot, picks it up, gets it out. And I mean, that's, if anyone goes to the net there, their goalie's hunting the net. That's a free goal for us. Um. 
another one where I'm kind of coming, I'm in the neutral zone, skating, middle ice, horizontally. I see out of the corner of my eye, our guy kind of uh, skating pretty fast toward their blue lines, and their D-men were out pretty wide, so there's a huge gap in between. So I kind of blindly swing it to him, and it ends up going too far in front of him for icing. And, you know, I thought in the moment, like, okay, this is a really good pass. So I was shocked that it was kind of so far in front of him. And then I talked on the bench, and he's like, oh, I didn't think you saw me, so I kind of eased up a bit. Uh, so, yeah, that was not ideal. Because if he kept going, I mean, he would have got there, and he would have been gone. The demon were way too out wide, and, I mean, he was... He would have got the pass just outside the blue line with just a whole ton of speed. So, unlucky. I mean, just so many little unlucky plays all throughout the last X amount of games. Uh, yeah, there's a couple more, but I'm too tired to go get into them. Uh, but the one thing is just, again, I mean, this was probably one of the games where I was shooting the least. Uh yeah, I just got to get smoother at crawling the puck. I mean, I had a chance right at the end where I get around a guy. I have the puck right in the middle with no one really around me, but the puck is just a bit too far to my reach. So I can't really drag it into my body and just whip it, which is how I like to shoot. So just little little things where it's inches out of my wheelhouse, and then because, because of that, I... Then I'm thinking pass because it's not my wheelhouse. So I ended up making a good pass. And then we went cross ice. And it should have been a tap in. But we missed it. So I just got to get way, 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 way better at shooting. And again, luckily I could practice that at lower level games or shinnies. Not to the same extent. But yeah, just the shooting is... When I have an absolute clean lock, pucks right in the wheelhouse, me, and I can shoot. Like, I'm pretty accurate, hard shot, but it's getting myself in those positions, receiving the puck, and then shooting quickly after, changing the angle, shooting in stride, shooting while I'm skating hard. Um, yeah, that's all things I got to work on, and I mean, I'm a bit concerned because my... Level of competition will be going down now that this season's done until next season. And now this is one practice a week. That's probably the most valuable practice I can get right now that won't be happening. So got to do my best to find substitutes and I'll get on as many teams as I can. But I do need to find more. So I'll be on the lookout for that. But. Again, I'm pretty happy with how I played, and hopefully with X more amount of practice, then along with preventing goals, I'm, I'm scoring them. So that's the goal. And this did turn into a rant. So rant over. <laughs>